Abao district is one of the remote districts in central province. Traveling by road takes hours for people to reach the district at quarter. Over the years, they have used water as the main mode of transport to access government services in Kupiano Station. People traveled from as far as Cloudy and Amazon Bays, Waningela Gabone, Kelerakwa and Aroma villages using banana boats and outrigger canoes. Considering maritime as the safest transportation route, Abao District Development Authority have purchased a new boat to roll out government services along these areas. MV Abao 2 will provide logistics and support for government officials to implement government services in health, education, for election purposes, and provide rescue and emergencies. We carry out our health patrols, education inspection trips, and also uh, surveillance and uh, sea ambulance work. If we have uh, referrals from, of patients from uh, rural health facilities to the health centers here, we want to use this, especially for the coastal areas of this, uh, of this district. The boat was purchased in Philippines at a cost of 1.2 million kina. Sitting MP and Public Service Minister Sepuka Temu urged crews to take ownership of the boat. Please, uh, Captain and the crew, comply with those requirements. Uh, don't go too fast all the time. Make sure that the boat is uh, looked after like a child. Because uh, the better we look after it, the longer it will save the people of Abao. The boat will carry a capacity of more than 20 passengers with luggage. So it's quite a big boat, 13 foot, uh, 13 meters long and uh, four meters wide, so it's quite a big uh, vessel. And uh, I think uh, when we brought it up from Mosby, it also, we, it was a good test. We came in a rough weather. It was used in a rough weather to come up here, and I, uh, according to people who have traveled in that boat who came around, it's uh, very good. It's quite steady and uh, reliable in uh, types of weather. Eric Arupman, National MTV News.